coming up. It feels like ages now since I've, I've watched Fairy Tale. I mean, maybe for you guys it's, it's been like whatever, but this is the first time me recording Fairy Tale in, in a long time. Trust me, it's been weeks. And um, what a nice break to take from Fairy Tale, you know, and to come back and seeing all, you know, sexy little Wendy here, Dragon Slayer. The evolution of this character is kind of nice, I guess. You know? <laughs> wow. Dude, look at her hair, too. She's gone full on Super Saiyan. Holy crap. Oh, in the countdown, right. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, give her credit. She's just developing her new powers. Whoa. And she's quick. Whoa. <laughs> what? <laughs> Activating cutting mode. Really? Really? But he's got cutting mode on! What could you ever possibly do? I don't even know what she did, but cool. Wow. Wait, she tossed him to the face thing? She destroyed it. Whoa. But what, what if it still counts down? Even if the weird statue is still broken! Oh my god! No. This is what I was expecting. No. Then again, I don't even know how is she even defeated or exhausted in what way, you know? Because when, when we look at it, if Natsu eats fire and he's healed, you know, Kajio eats steel, whatever, heal. Wendy is air. Air is everywhere. Right? Oxygen. She can constantly be healed. So I I don't know. I still don't understand how he was able to absorb no two lightning flames. How can we beat him if our attacks make him stronger? What a weird looking dude. What? How is it your fault? <laughs> that looks poorly animated. Stop 
Shush. How are you even talking without your lips moving? You got the meat I Jane. Oh, that's so silly. They're just standing there like, oh. Just breathe in, woman. Oh my, it's gonna be up to Carla. Really, Carla. For whatever, I guess. I mean, after that, I input this override code. Yay, she did it. Input accepted. The Ether Nano's combustible now. What does that mean? This timeline is about to go blank. This timeline? Time There's nothing to see. Oh, wait, what? Scar I can tell you with certainty this will stop fate and allow magic to endure. Then what's wrong? When I touch that button, fate will self destruct. <gasps> okay. The explosion. We won't be able to escape it in time. Okay? Everyone go die. Just, just have not to eat the explosion. God damn, I'm so cynical. After all, you've already done it back in Italy. I'll handle this. How can you ask me to do this? Oh my God, just do it and stop freaking arguing. I don't want to leave, but I don't want to die, but I don't want to leave. Okay, then you're gonna die. Stop bitching. You can't be forever when you're dead. Together. <laughs> this is silly. Just get on with it. Ah, they're dead. <laughs> they're not really dead, you know? This is what I get so frustrated with this show. You know? God damn. I just save your friends if they're dead. They're all about to die. And if they refuse to do the self-destruct shit. Alright, I am very confused. Okay, hurry up and press the damn button. Yeah, by the time they press the button, it's not even going to work. God damn, why are they talking so much? Uh, oh, is this when she first met Carla? 
I don't know. I feel weird. She's naked. <laughs> Why are you crying this time? Because I can't stop. Would you try at least? Well, maybe I could try to stop crying if you promise to be my friend. Oh my a god. Friend, a friend is someone who you like and, and um. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> so penderizing. It's not even a word. God damn, man. Yo, I, I had plenty of friends. I don't even know where the fuck they are, because they're gone. Friends don't stay forever, man. People do suck. I made a lot of friends. I don't even know where the fuck they are. Because they ain't friends anymore. Interesting. I'm picking up a great deal of magic power from her. <laughs> hey there, Kyla. You followed me here? Well, of course I did. You're far too young to be traveling unaccompanied, child. And also, I recall you saying that we'd be together forever. What are we we're doing an actual flashback? Oh, this is annoying. Very annoying. Because we get it. Yo, how many fake outs do we need in a show? Didn't we just do a fake death like not that many episodes ago? And we're doing yet another one? Oh my god. Look at the epic music. Yay! Oh, yay! It, it is frustrating. Very frustrating. Because it's... No one's going to die! Stop! Stop it! Would you be my friend again? Of course I would. would you be my friend again? What does that even mean?! What? Was, why?! Still not dead. God damn, man. It's been like an hour later. Um. Wait, wait, what? Are you shitting me? Really? What? Alright, what is that guy's name again? Mesh? Mace? Chase? Some, something. So he... This is what frustrates me with this show. And, and I'm going to be more realistic with this. You know, I don't want to overreact and be too sane and, and weird or whatever like I usually am, you know. Um, but this is what's so frustrating with this show. It's the padding there. Um, like, I feel like there was only maybe five minutes worth of an, an actual show, and the rest was long-gated, you know, um, background shots. You know, very slow-mode background shots. And then, oh, hey, let's remember when Carla and Wendy were whatever. Let's spend, like, five, six minutes doing that, and... And let's spend another six minutes of, will I push the button? I don't know. Should I? Shouldn't I? I would do it. It's frustrating because, like, taking the break from Fairytale energizes me to come back to the show open-minded, you know? But then I'm watching other TV shows and other anime shows, and I realize what frustrates me the most with anime, and it's just that, the padding. This is why I love shows like My Hero Academia, Kino's Journey, Wish Hunter Robin, just to name a few, you know, Fooly Cooly, um, 
they get straight to the story. They built the characters. They built the tension. They built the world. But here, it's just, let's extend the episodes as much as we can. And then you, the viewer, at least me, I realize, god damn, just get on with it. You know, it's like, god damn, 20 minutes of nothing. You realize you're just wasting your time. Now, I can understand why people could have nostalgia. You know, this could be their first anime. Maybe this is their first love in anime where, you know, you fell in love with these characters and these universe. And, man, it, I, ugh. It's okay. Wendy and Carla, the most, see, I don't know if I would call them the most unpredictable characters of the show. I feel like the show is saying that, which is kind of insulting because, like, literally in the last 30 80 episodes, whatever, maybe 100 episodes, Wendy has proven herself uh, to be definitely much more capable of being part of the group, you know? So, so to suggest that, oh my god, it was them that saved the day, I, I, don't know, I find that kind of insulting. That's how I feel when, oh my god, Lucy saved the day, because it's like, damn, fucking Lucy, she can't do nothing, you know? So, ow, no weird episode. Very weird. <laughs> So, as always, look, I'd love to hear your thoughts. So, discuss me down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. And as always, God bless you. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Yeah, I want the power, the fortune power and fame fortune But I'm running in the marathon with a torch in the rain I'm just a pawn in the game, the they're the saying game. off with his brain I'm going insane, losing my mind, losing my mind. the mind. illusion of time And this life is up to you to decide I'm gassed up, yup, Jupiter high Self-esteem gets my train of thought rolling Now this logo's in motion